Hi, after taking a lot of interest in activities of skeletal systems, we need to be proceed with other topic, sense organs. Already you have learned children in previous class, sense organs and how many types of sense organs are there and which parts of our organ connected with that sense organs to respond with that sense organs. Yes, human being can see, smell, taste, hear and feel with the help of these sense organs. These sense organs are what? Eyes, nose, tongue, ear and skin. With the help of eyes, children, you can see. With the help of nose, we can differentiate good and bad smell. Good smell means its fragrance and with bad smell. Tongue. With the help of tongue, we can differentiate the quality of food. The food is sweet, salty or what? Bitter in taste and sour also. The four type of taste, sweet, salty, bitter and sour. Okay, four type of taste buds present on our tongue. So, tongue, the organ respond to four type of tastes. Ear helps us to vibrate the sound, vibration of sound or listen the word of sound and skin helps to respond the cold, hot or any, if any wound would be there, the, our skin get respond with pain also. So, it helps us to observe pain too. These sense organs all these five sense organs collect the information and send the messages to the brain. Kaha bhezta hai? Brain ko. And for further processing, our body respond to that messages of our brain. If one of the sense organs getting disturbed, then our body can't work properly. So, keep well, the all sense organs because all sense organs are very important for the for the work of our body. Now, in details, we understand the sense organs. The sense organ first one is eyes. Okay, it is human eyes. Human eyes. The human eye is one of the most valuable sense organs, children that enables this enables to see the world around us let us study the different parts of our eyes the first one is cornea second pupil you have have you seen a round circle mark will be there third iris fourth lens fifth retina retina will be there then aqueous humor vitreous humor and one one more is optic nerves okay let's understand what are the function of these parts okay first one is cornea the outer bulging part have you seen all of you seen blue color these and blue color this not only this one carry this is i am indicating this one by arrow this is cornea what is the function of this cornea? It is convex in shape. Let us understand our hand portion. If we keep this hand in this way, the outer portion is called convex portion. And this type of figure presents our cornea. Okay, this is the bulging outside shape. Light first, suppose this is light. Okay, light first enters to into the eyes through cornea. Cornea ke hoti huye, lights jo hai, enter karta hai eyes ke. Okay. Second one is iris. Okay. Within two blue lines, there is green broad lines. All of you able to see? Okay. These broad lines or green lines is 
iris and what is the function of iris iris located behind cornea okay piche hai cornea ke and regulates amount of light enter into cornea by adjusting size of pupil increasing or decreasing intensity of light there is what amount of light enters into the cornea it depends okay it balance the amount of light okay suppose ki if uh, if if a torch light blinking towards your eyes reflects towards your eyes your eyes get blinking yes like this it is control the light that passes through the cornea by increasing and decreasing their size kabhi bada aur chota karke us lights ko control karta hai okay the third one is pupil a, a small circle a dark circle is there small pointed circle will be there this is pupil it is a hole in the middle of iris iris ke beech mein hai upper part and lower part of iris ke beech mein hai okay it decreases or increases its size depending on the intensity of light okay pupil also decreasing or increasing their size according to the intensity of light that get enters into our eyes now the next one lens eye lens okay this is eye lens the blue part the inner blue part all of you have seen the inner blue part the inner blue part is eye lens what is the function the eye lens is made up of jelly like substance which is made up of protein and it is held eye lens is held by ciliary mus- muscles very important parts of our body is this eye lens now our aqueous humor is there in our front part of eyes there is a jelly like substance that is aqueous humor jelly like substance i have written here also this is made up of aqueous humus water and salt with the combination of water and salt okay aqueous humor is made up of the next retina retina is the largest part of our eyes retina is the largest part of our eyes it is very delicate organ a large number of sensitive cells are there that is rod cells cone cells cone cells okay what is the function of rod cells respond to light and cone cells respond to color okay now the largest part filled within the retina is vitreous humor it is also made up of water like aqueous humor it is also made up of water and salt plus protein also now there is a fine thread like structure that is optic nerves okay what is the function of optic nerves okay it carries all the informations about the cornea pupil retina and lens it carries the information and sends send the information to the brain and brain respond our body then this is the framework or this is the uh, d- diagram of eyes i think all of you can able to understand if you have any problem in this diagram can you can ask with me okay thank you and uh, next topic is our nose other sense organ is our nose uh, ear i am giving you next video thank you